Hi guys, my name is Ryan and I am one half of TwoGuysGaming.com. The other half, his name is David and we are two completely different guys. I have a PC computer, he has a Mac computer. I have an Android, he has an iPhone. I'm white, he is black. But there is one thing that both of us enjoy doing and that is playing games. Whether it be on a Nintendo Wii, an Xbox, a PlayStation, a PC, a Mac, an Android phone, or an iPhone, whatever it is, we enjoy gaming. So if you're somebody who also enjoys gaming, make sure that you subscribe. The first game that we're going to be taking a look at is a game on the Android, and it is called Basketball Shot. Now if you've ever been to Chuck E. Cheese, you'll know what this game is all about. But before we get into it, I'm going to issue a challenge to all of you who also own an Android phone. That challenge is to see if you can beat my score after three rounds. I'm going to play this game for three rounds and I'm going to have a score. If you could film yourself, post it as a video response, and it's higher than my score, I will list your name right here with a link to your channel. So, the challenge is up. Let's see what this game is all about and let's play Basketball Shot. Now the object of Basketball Shot is very simple. You need to take the basketball and put it into the hoop. You do this by flicking the basketball towards the hoop. Wherever you flick your finger depends on where the basketball will go. Now you can either get two points or three points, but how you get those points is a little up in the air right now. Now I originally thought that you get three points by swishing it, but by taking a look back at this gameplay you can clearly see that some of my basketballs hit the rim and it still gives me three points. Whatever the case may be, you have to try to get it as close to the center of the basketball hoop as possible. Now you start off the game with 45 seconds. And there's kind of a system to this. You try to flick the balls in there as fast as possible. Now if you flick your finger really fast, you can clank it off of the backboard and miss it. Or if you don't flick it hard enough, you won't make it all the way there. So the first round is almost done. And as you're going to see, it looks like I might have a couple more balls to throw in there. And it looks like I ended up with 132. Now that's not my personal best. My personal best is 139. But stage one is cleared. And uh, we're going to go ahead and take a look at what stage two is. Now stage two is a little bit different. First of all, you know, you have to throw the balls into the hoop just like normal. But after a few seconds, the basketball hoop will actually start moving left to right. You also start off with less time than you do on the first round. So here's when the basketball hoop moves. Now this makes it a lot harder to get three pointers because it's hard to determine where the basketball hoop's going to be when the basketball gets there. The goal here is to throw the basketball a little bit in front of the hoop so that way you could try to get a three pointer. Ah, some awful shooting. Almost missed that one. And as you can tell, I got a lot less points during this round than I did the round before. Ended up now with 205. Stage 2 cleared. Let's play the last stage, which is stage 3. I uh, should emphasize here that you can keep on going. The game will actually give you a target score that you have to get before the round is over. Now if you watch towards the top where my score is to the right in the middle there where it's saying three points and two points, you also see that it says stage three and it tells you how many points you need in order to move on to the new round. The requirement for this round is 80 points. Obviously I've already made it way past that, but for this demo we're only going to play three rounds. And coming down to the final seconds here, and it looks like I ended up with 280 points. So again, guys, that's the challenge. 280 points after three rounds. Make sure you film yourself, and if you can get past that score, post it as a video response, and we will link your channel. Have fun, and thanks for watching.